Ed Donnelly, IFL TV in association with MGM Marbella. I'm here in London today for the Heavy Duty press conference. I'm here with none other than Reese Bomber Bellotti. <laughs> Reese, what's happening, mate? Yeah, not too much, mate. Yourself? You good? Yeah, I'm good, thanks. But you're always looking very dapper, aren't you? I try. You look like you should be in Marbella. <laughs> <laughs> Is it? So are you going to be on this card? I am on this card, yeah, yeah. So you've had a few on the Goodwin shows now. I know you won your last fight. Talk me through that first, actually, because I wasn't there because it's my birthday. Uh, against a tough Hungarian, I think he was. Uh, I've watched him a few times on YouTube and stuff. And he's took a lot of fighters a distance, so I weren't expecting to get a stoppage or nothing. But again, I got a stoppage in the second round. It was a good fight. You got a lot of power, like as much as for a slim man. You are. Everyone says how much power you've got. Is that something you take pride in? Uh, yeah, well, it's good for people to say, and, and it's good to hear, obviously, but, uh, yeah, no, I'm not too bad, I suppose. Have you got any names for this fight yet, or is it going to be a, that's going to get an import? Yeah, no, I've, I've no idea, no idea, it hasn't even been mentioned or spoken about, to be honest, so I wouldn't really know. Are you buzzing to be on such a big show? Oh, mate, it's going to be quality, isn't it? It's going to be a good night. Yeah. Obviously, the massive buzz at the O2, I can't wait. Your, two your calls and now the O2, it's a big step up. You, you, <laughs> you're handling it? You got this? Well, I'll just take it in my stride, but, yeah, no, it's a massive step up, but I can't wait. So are you still in camp now? Are you training still or are you having a bit of a break? Yeah, no, I'm just sort of ticking over. I always keep running. I always want to keep in shape so I'm not like, do you know what I mean, dropping myself in deep. But, yeah, no, I can't wait. Gym change your heart, do you know what I mean? Yeah. So. Oh, yeah, good old gym. Yeah, see it. <laughs> good old gym. Have you been had any time out? You been going anywhere? Just chilling? No, I went to uh, Manchester at the weekend, watched the boxing at the weekend. What do you think of uh, the crawler decision? Awful, mate. To be honest, it was bad. Was, yeah, it? I was there. And I just thought. I thought he won it without the points deductions, and I just. God knows what I was even looking at. To be honest, I was so angry, but then, like, you, you I was a bit confused. I thought, how, how have you not seen it like that? Yeah, everyone was just sort of looking at each other, going, "How? How? What? The, well, no, what the hell's going on?" Frankie up? Gavin literally, like, he stood up. I mean, it was one of the people have said that were there. Stood up on his chair, looked at the judges' scorecards, and see that it was a draw before he got announced. So all the matchroom sort of people, I think they knew before yeah. he got announced. So yeah, I can see Eddie sort of shaking his head and I think, oh, what's going on here? That's what he was like. First of all, oh, he ain't lost, surely. Yeah. So I come out of the draw, I was like, this is mad. I was sort of like half paying attention because I thought, oh, Crawler's won this now. And I just looked down and then you just heard, I think it was Jim Watt, he just went, oh, no. And I was like, what? <laughs> I know this is what I'm expecting, it's nuts, isn't it? No, it's mad, it's mad. Hopefully that it that never happens to you, hopefully. hopefully if you, not, when, yeah. when you win your world title, just exactly that, knock yeah. him out, you know? That's exactly it, get it over with. Exactly. How many more times are you going to be out this year? Obviously, you're fighting in September. Are you going to get one in before the end of the year? Or just... uh, well, I, I spoke to Eddie the other week. He said, hopefully, you'll get me out again in October, hopefully. But he's obviously going to let me know on dates and stuff like that. So, hopefully, I'll just keep busy. <laughs> And if you're not keeping busy, Jim will keep you busy anyway, so oh, you have okay, not got yeah, to worry about yeah, that. Yeah, beasted by Jim, that don't really matter. So. Maybe if you do fight in October, you'll be in one of Chunky's bills. Yeah. Is he going to get out? Uh, I'm not too sure. There's a lot going on there with Chunky. I'm yeah. not too sure what's going on, but oh, yeah, yeah, there I'd there love is a to bit. be on the, on the undercard of Chunky, definitely. All right, then, mate. Well, good luck at the O2 and good luck in training. And I love work with Jim. Make sure you don't train you too hard. <laughs> yeah, you're knackered. All right, catching a bit.